Hi, this video is from interview.com. Indeed.com is a job portal. If you're looking for a job, you can log on to Indeed.com and you can post your resume with us. In this video, I'm going to explain 35 Java exception related interview questions. This is the last part of it. Let's see the questions. 23rd. Is it possible to throw an error? Yes, it is possible to throw an error. Any throwable type include error. Is it possible to throw an object? No, we can use throw keyword only throwable object. Otherwise, we will get compile time error saying unreachable statement. What is the purpose of throws keyword? Throws keyword used to propagate the exception. That means I have called a method. In that method, I try to do something. I read a. F I try to read a file, and there there was a problem. And in the in the in that method, I'm I can't do it. I can't handle that exception. So I'm I'm propagating it. I'm throwing that exception to the called class called class or method so that he he has the knowledge how to handle it and find an alternative way to go to the normal flow. Okay. So that's where uh, throws comes into picture. What is the difference between throws and thrown? This is a little uh, uh, confusing que question. There is no such word called thrown in Java. Exception. Explain the exception handling keyword. The exception handling keywords are try, catch, finally, throw, and throws. Okay. Which class is the root class in Java exception hierarchy? Throwable class is the top class in exception hierarchy what is the difference between exception and error exception is you can recover you can recover from it error these are not caused by program mostly caused by lack of system resources you are said your db is down db server is down your file is not available your service is down something like that so you cannot recover what is the difference between checked and unchecked exception that exception checked by compile time is called checked exceptions the che that exception checked by compile time okay Exception which are not checked by compile time, those exceptions are called unchecked exceptions. For example, runtime exception. What is difference between partially checked and fully checked exception? A checked exception is said to be fully checked if and only if all the child class also checked. Otherwise, it is called partially checked exception. The examples are I/O exception, fully checked exception, exception, partially exception. What are customized exceptions? Sometimes, based on your programming requi requirement, we have to create our own exceptions, such as such exception called customized exception. Can you give the name of most common exception occurred in your previous proje project? Null point exception, array index bound of exception, stack overflow exception, class class exception, no class def found exception, no class class not found exception there are a lot of exceptions okay will the finally block executed if there is an exception thrown in try block yes the finally block will override the thrown exception finally always dominates please remember finally always dominates can we catch runtime exception yes we can catch or throw runtime exception but the compiler will not complain complain about it since it is a unchecked exception okay hope this video is useful for your java interview preparation thank you and all the best for your interview if you like this video please press the like button and subscribe button thank you